a lot of people out there. <laughs> anyway, I'm here to critique Hayden, Mr. Hayden four four nine. I don't know his last three digits. No one, no one ever fucking knows the last three digits in someone's username. It's like, oh yeah, I'm dog, I'm dog, I'm dog, I'm dog, I'm four four five. You're like, okay, dude. Hey, I'll catch you later, okay? You get to the computer, you're like, Dark, Dark, Albino, for, Damn it, what's that last digit? And you spend 30 minutes trying to search the web, search whatever you're on, YouTube, something, and... You know what, screw the critique on Hayden, I'm gonna go off on rants again. Once more. Once more. Like an emo does. Oh yeah. Anyway. So, you're like searching for 30 minutes to an hour. I spent an hour personally trying to find Hayden. An hour. An hour. An hour. A fucking hour. An hour. Anyway. When I found him, I'm like, hey, Hayden, create a video for me. I sent a video, made a video of. Me calling out him and Dirk Goldbergs on YouTube. Not one video. That was two weeks ago. I'm officially announcing there are no winners in this contest except for me. Because I seem to be the funniest out of all of them. Oh yeah. Bitches. And if, I, if you get offended that I cuss, get over it you pussy. Get over it. This is not some N NCC censored YouTube account. This is a full straight up independent indie DIY video. And yeah, that's kind of pissing me off. Like on the radio today, I was listening to the Santa scene. It's an arm race by Fall Out Boy. They bleeped out God but left the whole flipping damn it after it. So it'd be like, God! And it'd be like, mm, mm, something like that. Like, <coughs> damn, on face! And they're just, I'm like, if you're gonna bleep out some words, just bleep out the rest of them, please. Don't leave them. Or like, panic at the disco song. Uh, forgot the name. Uh, it's like, the din in it, din it, din in it, din it song. And they'll be like, they'll, they'll do the same thing. They'll bleep out God, but they'll leave. Damn it. Right there. And the reason they believe about damn it is because Christians complained. And I'm, I myself, I'm not going to release my religion. But I'm just saying, if you're going to ask for God to be erased, why don't you just ask for the rest of the word so we don't have to suffer here? I mean, I mean, it just ticked me off so much I wanted to go buy the censored one and burn it off my computer. Pay iTunes to burn the song. That's how ticked off I was. Another thing that takes me off is, like, people who ask you to get your hair cut really short if you're a guy. Guys, most guys know what I mean. Emos in the house watching this, goths, anybody. Really? My mom, my dad, my mom. Okay, let's start with my dad. My, came out, my dad came out to me, he's like, hey, Nate, you should get a haircut. I'm like, okay, uh, well, I need to plan on doing that. How about today at three? I'm like, yeah. Um, I'm sorry. I have I have a band practice today at three. How about tomorrow at four when I have something else to do? Okay, that works too. What the fuck? Then my mom's like, Nate, you're getting your hair cut. That's the last word. You're getting your hair cut today. In two minutes get get down here with your shirt off so I can give you a haircut. I went up to my room. Wait, called my friend, had my friend call my mom about a sleepover, and then from there it evolved into my mom talking to his mom for about an hour, and my mom completely forgot about it. Good one for those who know how to use a distraction well. And quietly, quietly, let me do it. And then, uh, I was on the bus today, my Jay Rotsy friend from high school, he's like, Hey, dude, you should get your hair cut. 
did you get your hair cut today? I'm like, really? Really? Did that make, did that make me fall into your military standards of J. Rossi, which is not really a military. It's just a little group of people who want to copy the military so they can get a scholarship to college that they can't pay for themselves. It's like, oh, and it's an easy A, too, by the way. He's like, uh, why do you think I joined it? I'm like, didn't really stab myself with the microphone. I didn't have it with me at the time. If I did, I'd record and go right into it. That's how stupid some people are. Some people are so stupid, they'll Jared and Jay Rodsey for no reason but to get an A, so they seem smart. Sorry for those who go because they want to and join the military. I respect that. Peace, peace. But for those who join J. Rodsey just to get an easy A, suck it. It's doing nothing for you. Well, it sort of is, but it's not really doing anything for you. You're not learning the important stuff like science, which is right here, by the way. It's right there. That's that book. This is science. Yeah, that's educational right there. But anyway, like, I'll be there. My, my friend's dad's like, hey, I'll pay you. I'll pay you. Uh, I'll pay you $50 to get your hair cut. I'll be like, like, how about you give me $50? I'll pretend to go get a haircut. And then come back to you say, I got, I got a haircut with my hair. Oh, yeah. Like this. So it looks like I got a haircut. And then I'll keep the $50. Um, uh, no, that's not going to work. Well, then, uh, no, I'm not going to get a haircut. Oh, ooh, best thing ever. The adults in my Boy Scout troop? Yes, I'm in the Boy Scouts, so... Yeah. Anyway. Don't give me a lip. I can already see you. Oh, he's in the Boy Scouts. I'm not going to watch him. I'm going to turn it off now. Anyway. Boy Scout troop. One of the adults came up to me. He's like, hey, so Nathan, what are we doing? I Blah, blah, blah. Some time later, he's like, oh, I should, I should. I'm sorry. You were flipping your hair the entire time. I'm like, I'm sorry. I like, I like long hair. I'm sorry. I don't want to conform to your military standards. And it's just like, I can see it well up in his eyes. I was like, I'm not going to talk to you again until you get a haircut. At the end of the meeting, he came up. He was like, I'm lying. I'm going to talk to you again. Like, People are stupid. Do not listen to them. They lie. They lie to us. See what I mean? I can go on for hours about stupid people at my school. Probably go off on one right now. You know, the people, the... The people who say, oh, I hate drama. It's it's like so much problem. So much. So much. And you're just going in your mind. <coughs> Sorry. What? what? You say you hate drama. <coughs> what? Yeah, because you know those people are the ones who cause the problems and drama in the school. I can't take drama anymore. Can you? High schoolers, can you take the drama anymore? No. No one can. Let's let's stack fat books. This fat, fat, that fat into my backpack, full of shit ton of homework. And then let's add let's add sitting in class for an hour and a half listening to a teacher that's going, "Hey, you sit down." I said no talking. I'm wake up. I know you got here at six, but some teachers are like this. I know you got up at 6 to be here so I could teach you, but give me the time, respect me so I can teach you, and don't sleep. You're going, kindergartners are up at 6, I'm up at 10, they're ready, the kindergartners are already at 6.30 to go to school. I think you should send them at 6.30 and take them at 12, and then let the high schoolers go from 10 to 4. I don't care, I just want to sleep in. Sleep is the most important thing in my life right now. Sleep. Sleeping with the woman. Or a man, if you like that. Or a man. Or a man. Sorry. Just. I love looking at myself talking to the microphone. I'm like that. Anyway, I have to cut this short. Running out of time. YouTube, very strict on time. Till next time. Peace out. Rock on. Emails. Go do whatever you want to. Goss. Punks. Bye. Go break something, punks. I don't care about you anymore. Bye.